Are you facing problem to install Google Chrome browser on your Windows 10 computer? Some of the Google Chrome users complaining that they are not able to install the Chrome browser on their Windows 10 computer. So after analyzing the matter, I'm going to present some effective solution that's going to fix Google Chrome installer fail to start error on your Windows 10 operating system. So before I do, let's jump into the main video. So in order to fix the Chrome installer fail to start error, First of all, you need to go ahead and open up your search bar and type regedit. So here's the best mask. Here you can see the Registry Editor app. So I'm just going to go ahead and click over here. And after opening the Registry Editor page, just go ahead and expand. The second option is Ace Key Current User. Just going to click this arrow button in order to expand this one. And after that, just go ahead and expand this software option. And under the software, just go ahead and find out the Google folder. So here it is. So what we're gonna do over here, we're gonna just delete this folder from here. So just right click over here and then select delete and then it is asking for the permission. Just go ahead and click on yes and then the folder will be deleted from here. So the reason behind deleting this folder, it's actually when you delete the Google folder, it's actually create a new folder for the installation and your problem will be solved. And we're gonna do the same thing for HK local machine. So in order to do that, just go to the software option and then right click over here and then click on go to local machine and the local machine path will open like this and inside the local machine and then software you just go ahead and find out the Google folder again just right click over here and then simply delete this folder from here and then click on yes if you get this kind of error then you need to fix some setting so in order to do that just right click over here and then go to the permission and then click on advance and then from this window just go ahead and click on this change option and type your everyone and after that just go ahead and click on this option check names and after that just go ahead and click on OK and then check mark this option replace owner on the sub containers and object and then check mark this option as well and after that just go ahead and click on apply and click on yes and then OK and after that just go ahead and close the window from here and then just try to delete this folder click on yes and see the folder has been deleted. So after deleting this Google folder from both of this option, you just go ahead and close the window and then simply just restart your computer. So after restarting your computer, you just go ahead and check your issue that it is working or not. If it is still not working, then let's follow the last and final method to fix this problem. So in this time, I'm gonna go ahead and open the run command. You can do this by using your physical keyboard. Just press the key combination Windows plus R and open the run command and type over here percentage local app data. Then again, percentage and then after that just press enter and you'll get to see a few folders that are available over here so just go ahead and find out the google folder from here so here as you can see the google folder so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna delete this folder from here as well go ahead and click on delete and then the folder will be deleted after doing all the process just go ahead and check the problem is fixed or not so here as you can see we have successfully installed the google chrome browser in my windows 10 computer so hope after doing all this process, you will be able to fix your Google Chrome installer fail to start error on your Windows 10 computer. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next video and thank you very much for watching.